gives a shit. He's such a complainer. I'm so sick of these people talking about what's wrong with the Matrix. Start telling them how to get out. Yeah, it really, that it has to be the focus. Because you can go on and on about it, what's wrong with it, but then what? Then, you know, yeah, get the fuck out. I get it. Solution orientated, that's us. I like that. You yeah. know, and that's I fine, am. like really. I said, you know, I just, and it's great to find the co-op, but how do you get out of it? If you're going to tell me to go in and find my higher self and love, give me a bit more. How? How yeah. the fuck do I find that up? Higher self, there's another one. Fuck that. Yeah, I can't. I just know. Just know. Just no age dogma. Suck me off. Yeah, no, no. You know, and all the other thing is when they start talking about third dimension, we're going to the fourth dimension. <sighs> See you there. I... <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Bring on the fifth dimension. I... I don't know what it is. People, if people are more so obsessed with the fifth dimension or going to the fifth dimension than the fourth. I don't fucking get it. Because they don't, I don't I just, they think the fourth the astral plane. You know, and it's like, how about you just get rid of the consciousness invasion and get back to the organic timeline? How much easier than that is that than trying to jump dimensions? Which don't exist. Yeah. <laughs> They just you're just jumping into another part of different the realities exist. Parallel realities exist, but different dimensions. Think about it. Think about it. Feel about it. It's just another way to be fucked. It's just another no age dogma that's got just a tagline. Oh, it's multi dimensional. What the fuck does that mean? Oh, like, um, you know, from another dimension, you know, whatever. What does that mean? They're taglines that people adopt, like, here we go again, the list, sovereignty. (laughs) (laughs) I get it. You know what I'm saying? I I get it. I totally These get vagaries it. of perception that they have no fucking wisdom experience or connection to, but higher self told them, no, no mm. fucking no. Once again, essence, the whole management team. It's not above you. It's not below you. It doesn't know more than you. It embodies everything. Yeah. I've never heard anyone who started to embody essence I say started to because, you know, I really haven't heard it from this moment ever refer to higher self again. Yes. Never. Same. Same. In fact, everything else is debunked because of the embodiment. Debunking yeah. bitches. Mm-hmm. Essence is where it's at. It, yeah. Essence For me, only that black. is the thing that really, It is, Yeah. Get it. I just love your impressions. That's all. It's just, it's just so funny, and I, I love it when <laughs> I, it really, it just it really does it for me when you do it. It just, <laughs> yeah, it makes me. Because I'm, I'm listening to them, and I'm not a complete asshole mostly. It's more. I mean, I start off at compassion with it at first. I'm like, oh, fuck, I know that one. And then when they keep going, and then when they keep going, then when they keep correcting me, but they want my tech, and then when they, it's just like it gets boring. Then I start yeah. to breath test. Is this an anarchy? Oh, hello. Shut it. Goodbye. You know, because they're going to mm. argue. It's going to go around around their heads. It's a cerebral concept. They have not embodied. Mm. They've not grounded it. And they don't really think they need to because they'll get a machine to help them. <sighs> so fucking boring. I'm not going to develop yeah. my psychic side. I'm just going to get a machine that tells me a vision. I'm not going to develop my connection to Moo. I'm just going to take a drug to feel it. Yeah. You know, it's like, seriously? Not that I'm adverse to that. No. Seriously? <laughs> yeah, but as as the only thing, you know. I mean, like, yeah. Well, it's, it's always using something outside of yourself to get something that you desire. And it doesn't have to be. 
at all. Yeah. Your desire alone will magnetise it to you. Anyway, yeah, it that's does. a lecture for another day. Mm. So until hey, we I wanted my dear. Huh? I, I I wanted to quickly kind of run by run something by you in the session today. I don't I I don't know if it was like the lineage or if it was the girl, but I saw so much water within the session. And I saw so much, it's like water became her. And I don't know if it was like lineage doing something or if it was something else. Well, what, was her her li- what was her lineage? I don't know. What was her I, I, I was a, Well, she was. It's an organic, a dimension of self could be coming online. It could be the cetacean self. It could be, um, when we're talking about dimension of self here, dears, if you go back and have mm-hmm. a little listen we're not talking about dimensions. We're talking about dimensions of self, whole different ballgame. Yeah. Yeah. So, just, just clarifying. Could be a dimension of yeah. self, could be... Um, my first thing was an elemental. So her elements or her elemental, like her body elemental, could relate through water. Remember before... This is what- we were talking about, you know, because your thing's water, you're going to bring that out and others? This is what I was thinking because when I we got think talking feel. afterwards. I know, I, I know. Well, I kind of felt it and I was, yeah, thinking, feeling, whatever. Um, but she she does, she responds well to water. That's what kept coming mm-hmm. through afterwards. I just found it really interesting how we were talking about it and then it came through. And so then go through and reprogram her water. So take out the magnetics that's holding blah, 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 blah. And then let her go in and pull the magnetics of the organic timeline. Okay. And essence. So, so let me just be clear. So, can you say, can you say that again? Fucking hell! <laughs> go and get your fucking blonde cap on, love. I'm I saying, don't. take the magnet. Like your entry to her can be through her elemental body, water, or through the elemental realm. And she seems to respond through water. So I'm saying take out the magnetics of whatever it is you're clearing and flood the magnetics there with essence. Okay, I get you. I get you. So that'll reset essence. And of course, you know, essence all the way back to the organic timeline. That should reset her waters to be at least having a choice to read the codes from there. Okay. So what I'm I'll, saying I'll... is if she's here in the matrix experience and the organic timeline's here, water may be her bridge. Right. Yes, I understand. Okay. I'll do that in my ride for her when I... Ride it, bitch. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. The session never ends. Yeah. I just, I just, I just found it really interesting and I kind of just wanted to get another perspective, but now I'll play with it some more because I, I just fine. love that it's come online. And ever since I've been connecting to the organic timeline, I've been seeing more colours. Like this, it's just getting really exciting. It's getting really exciting now. Well, you must have had a boring life before. No. Uh, I was like, what did I do with my life before the organic? I know, right? I know. I know. Yeah. How did I live without Moose Soul Star beaming upon me? How did I live without that colour? igniting my spine i don't fucking know i don't i didn't live i didn't live it just i just i i can't it, one thing i know i can't go back there is just no going back once you have soul star you'll not go back 